When you transfer your website to Rage Web Hosting, not only will you get a reliable host, but you will also receive an all-in-one place for your domains, hosting, software, and SEO needs. If you already have a domain, it is very easy to transfer your domain to Rage Web Hosting. The process will take less than 5 minutes. The first thing you want to do is email your current domain registrar and tell them to unlock the domain and send you the EPP or authorization code. Most registrars will let you do this on your own, but if you don't want to do it on your own, you can just send them an email. In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to obtain the authorization code from your GoDaddy account. The process should be fairly similar with any other registrars, but note that some will refer to the code as an EPP code, while others may refer to it as an authorization code. So to do this in GoDaddy, you will first need to open the domain manager by clicking on My Products under the My Account tab. Then click on Domain Manager which is located on the left hand side of the window under My Products. When the domain manager opens up, click on the domain you wish to transfer. Under the heading Domain Information, there are two things we will need to do. You will see Authorization Code, like I mentioned earlier, with a send by email link right beside it. Click on the link and have the email sent to you. The next thing is to unlock the domain which will allow us to transfer it. As you can see, this domain is currently locked. To change this, press the manage button and uncheck the box to unlock the domain. Once you have received that code, you can go to the Rage web hosting page, which is located at ragesw.com slash webhosting.php or by selecting hosting in the navigation menu on ragesw.com. The next thing you'll do is press the sign up now button. On the first page of the shopping cart, you will need to select the second option, which reads, I want to transfer my domain to Rage web hosting. Then type in your domain. This is a really important step if you are transferring your domain. If you keep it on the default option, which is for registering a new domain name, then you will be told that the domain is already registered, which would be true because it is currently registered by you. On the next page, you can choose your billing cycle and add any add-ons that you might want. On the next page, here is where you will enter the EPP or authorization code that you received from your registrar. When you are finished with the sign up process, you will receive an email within a few hours. Included in this email will be your FTP login details to publish your site, as well as the name servers that you will need to update your website. You will then be able to go back to your registrar and update your name servers. In the same section where I got the authorization code and unlocked the domain, there is a link that says set name servers. You can click on this link and update the information to include the name servers that you received in your email from Rage Web Hosting. When you are done, you will receive an email within the next few days telling you to approve the transfer.